welcome to the aerospace engineering department of iit kanpur here we look at um, various aspects of aeronautics and aerospace this includes aerodynamics propulsion flight mechanics and control and structural aspects of aeronautics and space related technologies in terms of flight mechanics and control we look at um, the ways we can understand flight uh, both in terms of drones in terms of aircraft in terms of rockets uh, and of course satellites and space vehicles as well we also have a very impressive array of Uh, experimental facilities which include the flight laboratory where we have actually live aircraft where we can test aircraft systems If we talk about aerodynamics we look at uh, flow physics of flows which are at very low speeds um, say for example if you are looking at insect flight bird flight or very high speeds if you are talking in terms of missiles uh, rockets and uh, you know reusable launch vehicles so our idea is to develop um, new theories new diagnostic tools to understand the physics around these bodies so that we are able to design and increase the performance of these vehicles we also have many wind tunnels where you can look at the aerodynamic properties of various shapes and sizes and of aerospace vehicles
many of my colleagues are looking at uh, ways of improving these designs by looking at um, you know combustion diagnostics From a structures perspective, we also look at materials, uh, material behavior, structural behavior of uh, different vehicles, different aerospace vehicles. We also encourage our faculty to uh, take their ideas forward in terms of establishing companies, founding companies and mentoring new startups. We also encourage our students to participate in different uh, events so that uh, they get an exposure to the real world problems. The department also works very closely with uh, defense agencies such as DRDO, uh, space agencies such as ISRO, scientific and technology agencies such as CSIR so that our faculty works very closely with these agencies to look at problems that are need to be solved in for the next generation of aerospace vehicles and systems.